Hey guys, so yesterday I talked about Queens. So tonight it's time to talk about Nassau County. All right, so in Nassau County, we had 997 new listings, 623 under contracts, 914 closings, 247 leases, and then you had 323 price changes along with 46 extensions. So that's with active listings at 3,857, right? So again, we see that trend of price changes in about a third of those that have hit the market or that are have been on the market. And uh, we continue to see that through Queens, through Nassau. And it's, it's definitely a market that we're keeping an eye on, like I said before, not just on a six month to a year basis. We're looking at it month by month, week by week, day by day. And we continue to keep an eye on the interest rates, on inflation, on pretty much the economy as the year continues. Here are the numbers for Suffolk, where you see over 1,100 new listings, 915 under contract, 1,242 closings, 204 leased units, 299 price changes again, along with 70 extensions. So you see the trends continue along Queens, Nassau and Suffolk counties.